Hey guys, so in this video, I'm gonna just have an introduction. I'm just probably gonna be talking, and honestly, it's probably gonna be really boring. But I'm gonna share a little bit about my life, um, my photography, and yeah. So if y'all wanna keep watching, then that'd be awesome. So basically, I started photography in sixth grade, and I started with this little little camera right here. But I started with this. I don't even know what it's called. It's like Optio E30. I don't know. And like it literally won't even won't even work. Like the batteries are broken. Um, and I'm gonna insert some pictures from sixth grade. So that's pretty cringy. But I started in sixth grade because I really wanted a way to make my Instagram cool and I was like all about self-confidence and photography was one of those ways to just boost my ego and something to do with my friends like we'd always go outside and just take pictures and my friends would model for me with this little camera. <laughs> Um, I used this for about three years, it's like a really long time, and then I actually switched over into this Olympus. Um, I would say my freshman year of high school, um, and that was when people started asking me to do senior pictures, and were like, hey, we just want some pictures, and I was like, okay, cool. I didn't really charge anything, and I was like, okay, this is fun, like, a good way to just, like, have a side hobby, I guess, um, and at the time, I was still taking a lot of photos just for my Instagram, and I think I was getting more of a grasp on my style and what I wanted my photos to look like. Um, so actually, right now I'm filming on the camera I use now, but I'll insert a picture of it. It's a Nikon D5300. Um, I used to shoot with my oh, with my 35 millimeter lens. So every portrait photographer basically ever uses a 50 millimeter. Um, I decided that 50 was a little bit too tight for me just because I really love, love wide angle shots. So I chose to get a 35mm. I also have the 50 but I just haven't used it that often. So I would say my sophomore or junior year of high school, definitely sophomore year, um, people started asking me more to take senior pictures of them and I started charging money for them. And I would say it grew into something so much more than I thought it would be. Like when I started doing a photo, I was like, yeah, it's fun, cool. But I think the more I did it, the more I actually fell in love with it. Okay, so that this video has been a lot about my photography and my journey with equipment and how I grew as a photographer. 
but I'm going to share a little bit about who I am besides Photo. Um, I'm like weirdly obsessed with plants and if I show you all my room, I can probably show you. Hold on. Like here's some plants, there's some more, there's one right here and one right there. Also, obviously, I don't have a vlogging camera, so so I just kind of have to make it work with what I have, and this camera I use is for a photo and more portraits, but I guess I can use it for vlogging. If anyone wants to teach me how to use this for vlogging, please send help. I also really love this cat shirt. don't really know why, but I do and scrunchies and my surfer watch that everyone makes fun of me for and the color yellow and that's that's basically me so if you made it this far um congratulations second of all um hit the subscribe button um and give this a thumbs up and i really appreciate it if y'all could comment down below some ideas you have because so far i have like behind the scenes, photo shoots, how I edit, um, before and afters, and then some like thrifting vlogs. But if you want to see anything else like back to school or my college dorm stuff, just let me know because I'm going to need all the ideas and I leave in three weeks. So, yep. Okay.